And this is what cash flow in looks like. So this here, I need this. Inkos has asset liability. Again, this is, you get a job. And this was my poor dad, go to school, get a job, get your PhD. And so this here is cash flow. So the income comes in and it goes out this way. First line of expense is tax. So this is a poor person's cash flow pattern. It's not how much money you make. Most people, you know, they, I don't care if you have a PhD or no school at all, but they can't control the cash flowing out through their expenses. And so that's why people like Susie Orman say, cut up your credit cards, live below your means, because you're a spendaholic. So that's a poor person. This is a middle class person's cash flow pattern. And this is where the house comes in. They, first thing, you know, most kids do when they get pay raise and all that, they buy themselves a bigger house. Oh, my house is an asset. Now, who tells you that? Your real estate agent, of course. Yeah. <laughs> right? Because they, they want to give you this false sense of security while you're getting screwed. Yeah. 